random act. In the South Bay, the man accused of intentionally running down eight pedestrians in Sunnyvale made his first court appearance. Afterwards, investigators dropped a bombshell. Based on our investigation, new evidence shows that the defendant intentionally targeted the victims based on their race and his belief that they were of the Muslim faith. 34-year-old Isaiah Peoples did not enter a plea. His arraignment has been postponed until May 16th. ABC7 News reporter Amanda Del Castillo has the update. A bombshell statement from the Sunnyvale Department of Public Safety. The chief says Tuesday's crash could have been racially motivated. New evidence shows that the defendant intentionally targeted the victims based on their race and his belief that they were of the Muslim faith. The Council on American Islamic Relations says many Muslims already question safety at mosques or in headscarves, adding Tuesday's crash brings that concern onto city streets. People may not realize this, but the victims here were actually not Muslim. They were mistaken for Muslim by the assailant. Police say Peoples was on his way to Bible study Tuesday night. His family and his friends all describe him as a religious man. We connected with his congregation, Renewal Church in Sunnyvale, which often rents out space at the city senior center. Lead pastor Ulysses Wang shared this statement with ABC 7 News, which reads in part, Isaiah Peoples first came to our church roughly one year ago. We've never witnessed any behavior from him that would lead us to suspect that he could do something like this. Peoples' lawyer says the defense is disputing DPS's claims the crash was deliberate, instead pointing to Peoples' military background and changes to the suspect's mental state after serving. This act clearly was a product of some mental disorder or mental defect that caused this to happen. If convicted, Peoples would face life in prison. Outside the Hall of Justice, Amanda Del Castillo, ABC 7 News.